join me today and welcome to the beautiful Casa I'll share with you one of our top luxury listings. Sarah Brightlander here, owner of Crane Luxury Real Estate, and we have four offices located throughout the Guanacaste region of Costa Rica to service all of our clients' needs. Today, I wanna to take, take you on a video tour of a very special home. This is a three bedroom, two bath, standalone home with its own private pool, um, located in the Surfside Estates neighborhood of Playa Potrero. So we are gonna go on a tour today of Casa Four Palms. And let me tell you first off what this home is not, okay? This is not a brand new, modern, sleek home. It isn't. It also is not at that price point, okay? Those are higher price points, um, lovely homes, but I like this home because you're gonna see mature vegetation, tons of character, an amazing layout, um, exquisitely maintained. I mean, the owners have really taken good care of this home and the, the price point is great. To be able to acquire something like this for under half a million dollars is quite honestly phenomenal. Uh, and we rarely get product in, you know, in that price range because there are a lot of new uh, homes being built and that's great, but you have to be able to afford those. So to, to be able to have the standalone home at this price point is really, really nice. We had one, I don't know if you saw, um, Casa Amanacer that came on the market just three weeks ago, already under contract, multiple offers in this price point. So this is why I'm bringing it to you. Our photographer is here, you may see him. I'm trying to get you in <laughs> as fast as possible to see this listing. Okay, be sure to follow us on Instagram at Sarah in Costa Rica and at Crane Costa Rica so that you are seeing the latest and greatest in real estate. But let's get, I want to, I want to show this home. It's really just a lovely home. So we're going to enter through the gardens. This is the front yard here. I like it because um, low maintenance, right? Um, you know, you can do gardening if you want, um, but it's not that you have to be out here every day. They've got limon trees here. You can see the fruit, they can't eat them and use them fast enough. <laughs> because uh, they just produce so well. There's also a producing grapefruit tree on this side. And just look at the flowering uh, bougainvilleas, just really beautiful. You're gonna see the owners here have a very green thumb, unlike me, um, and it really shows. I have walked, you know, I've lived in this neighborhood for almost a decade now, and I have walked and jogged past this place, seeing the Four Palm sign out front, never being able to know what was back here. So when the owners called me and decided to finally list, I was so excited because I've always wondered what lied uh, back here. So you can enter here, so you can see they ha you have secure parking, it's gated. You can pull right in here, and, and this serves as a carport, right? Um, covered carport, you can use rain or shine. I have seen homes um, like this where people close this off and actually add another bedroom so you know you have that option you don't need really need permits for that because you're not really changing the the roof line the structure so anyway that's something to consider if, if you need more bedrooms right um, you can see look at the garden we're gonna see more of this from the back side but you have banana trees here just really really nice and this is kind of the back end of things uh, and it looks that nice okay come on come with me so we enter here like I said, we have the photographer here, so we have to step over some things. But look at this. Isn't this really nice? So I told you it's an older home, but it really has great character. Couple of things, uh, vaulted ceilings, and that's that Costa Rica hardwood uh, that you just rarely see nowadays because it's, it's cost prohibitive uh, to put in. And then this opens up to the kitchen. You have a nice island here. This is all Costa Rican hardwood that you see here. I also like that, you know, plenty of window space, right? Plenty of windows coming in here to let light in. Couple of things um, for you to note, I've seen my clients do is, um, I love the hardwood and I hate to paint over it, but a lot of my clients have brightened their kitchen by just changing out the granite that's easily available here to maybe changing it to quartz. And also they'll paint the cabinets like the two-tone color, which is kind of nice. So you have that option or you can leave it as it is and it's, it's perfectly fine. Uh, I love this too, the wine rack. And there's, there's a ton of uh, storage here. So no worries there. Come with me. Usually, you know, I like to save the best for last. But this is my favorite part of the home and it just, it lends itself to just come out here and it's so inviting. So I wanna show you this actually first. Guys, look at this outdoor space. Look at how much you have. You have multiple tables out here, outdoor kitchen, grill station, bar with your friends. 
You could totally redo that and make it as fancy as you want, but it's super comfortable right now. And then you have outdoor dining for six here. You have another lounge area over here. And guys, this is all covered. This is all covered here, so you can use it rain or shine. And in my opinion, this is where you're gonna do your outdoor living, for sure. Look at this pool, oversized pool. Like I said, super well-maintained. Yes, it's an older home, but the, the, the bones are excellent and they just keep it super well-maintained. Um, also, and, and there's a wall around the perimeter, this is a green zone back here. Um, so you get all this nature and just this morning, there were two cans back here, the Arakari, I believe, I'm saying that correctly. Um, and they come in the mornings. We couldn't get it on the, ca on the camera. We weren't fast enough, but I mean, that's pretty cool. You don't really get that uh, as much as I wish you did in, in service estates because it is being developed, but it's nice that they have that, uh, that nature back there, right? So this is kind of the back end of things. You have a huge, nice size storage room over here. We have another little sitting area. There's also a room back here for your bike storage and laundry. And you know me, I like to take you on the tour so you can see all dimensions and all aspects of the home. So if you wanna come on over here, we can kind of show you how this goes around. And now we're back, remember, at the carport, right? And the side entry of the home. Okay, let's check out the principal bedroom first here. So right this way, every bedroom has sliding glass doors uh, out to this covered area, which I love. And all screened in, really well maintained, so that's kind of nice as well. This is the principal bedroom here, okay? Traditional kind of Costa Rican home, you know? I don't, we don't have these in our, in our portfolio as much as, as we'd like in our inventory, so this is kind of nice. And then here's the bathroom, check this out. Shower here. All right, so we'll go back out here and we will go in, where are we going? We're gonna go in bedroom number two. <laughs> so go right ahead. All sliding glass doors out to this covered area and all screened in, which is kind of nice. And here is the third bedroom. You know, one thing I wanted to mention too, uh, super easy that anyone can do, uh, and it only takes about five, six days. Um, I mean, I love, like I said, the Costa Rican hardwood, and you don't see that as much anymore. But the trade-off is it's a little dark, right? And I have had many clients simply whitewash or paint that wood white, and you would be amazed at the difference it makes and how it lightens a room. And you could also do that with the door. So it just depends on your style, of course. But this is the third bedroom. And then the, the second and third bedroom share this bath here. Okay, so we'll come back out here. I think we've been able to show you everything. Oh, where are we in proximity to the beach? So I would say we are about less than a five minute walk for sure uh, to the Calm Beach of Playa Potrero. You're in Surfside Estate, so you're just walking distance to all the restaurants, bars, activities, uh, and the beach, of course. So thank you so much for your time. This is Casa Four Palms. So make sure if you're interested in this, contact me or a crane agent today. Thank you so much and Pura Vida.